<laughs> All right, guys, good morning. And I'm here with two-time Oscar nominee Joe do his hit with Channing Tatum, Tatum 21 Jump Street. Yes. And we're going to talk about the movie in just a second. But first, we want to address what happened over the weekend. You had a mm -hmm. run-in with a photographer where you used language that you regret. You've apologized mm -hmm. for what you've said. And you move on back now to the movie. Mm -hmm. On the heels of your Oscar-nominated run, Wolf of Wall Street, what made you say, you know what, let's do 22 Jump Street? <laughs> I just wanted to have fun. I have to know, what was it like behind the scenes? Because you guys do have such great chemistry on screen. Off screen, it probably just spilled over. But he's more than he's just really, eye candy, right? Well, he's great at everything. I mean, he's like... Us all probably relive our college days. You went back to college. You went to college here in New York, correct? I did, brief, uh, briefly. I had a brief tenure at New School University. Did it make you miss the college days? A depressed, we shot right? at Tulane in uh, New Orleans, and everyone... Crazy uh, stunts, though. You weren't too old to do some pretty amazing impress stunts. For sure. All right, 22 Jump Street, though, hits theaters on Friday. Thank you so much for joining us, Joan. Well, on and on, <laughs> the years of what he's done. Have, uh, it, too much time. A tuna fish can one time lodged in his mouth for oh, eight hours. Oh. Let's go ahead and get to the forecast. That's right. And talk about what's happening. Uh, that would be uh, Philadelphia we wanted to check in on. Because yesterday you saw the storm reports in the Midwest. Well, we had them in the Northeast, too. Today we wake up dry, but more storms headed our way tonight. A high for... Philadelphia 85 83 for New York City right along that warm front though those storms will ride and then we have to mention the heat Oklahoma City could see a record today and we do have high heat warnings in parts of Arizona your local weather forecast in just 30 seconds but first the stormy cities brought to you by Cosequin pet supplement we love having celebrity guest correspondent blackish star Anthony and one day away one day away we actually have a sneak peek Anthony Let's is lecturing the kids on the N-word. Take a look. She almost said. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you all have taken on so many controversial topics with mm -hmm. comedy and entertainment, but also with heart and enlightenment. Right. But the N-word is the taboo of all taboo topics, yes. and yet you took it on. Why? We, we, we took it on. Um, you know, we really wanted to do it last year. I know that you are always pushing the envelope. What can we expect this season? Uh, well, we're coming out. Part of the show? We are. How's we that are. going? Uh, they haven't returned any of the petitions or the calls <laughs> or the letters or the emails. I think I'm banned from going to Washington, D.C. now, not just the White House. <laughs> They're keeping me out of the District of Columbia. Well, at least you're entertaining them. Yeah, yes. Because we've been promoting this. We're going to turn the tables here now. I know you're that a what host we're gonna do? on the Food Network, so you're, you're used to being a host, right? Yes, yes, I am. So yes, I am. I think it's time now. We All should right, turn, turn the tables. The tables. Where's literally, my turn to table music? Literally and figuratively. <laughs> We switched places. We switched places. All right. Okay, joining me now is Good Morning American News. And how are you? Thank you for having me. No, thank you for gracing me with your presence. <laughs> um, how does this turn the tables things feel so far? Um, I mean, really it's working good. for you? It, you just said lots of nice things about me, so keep going. It takes the onus off of you. you see, my, my first question, in my extensive research for this segment, I learned that you were a gymnast as a child. Did you ever win a gold <laughs> medal at the Olympics? <laughs> no, but I got third place on vault once. Okay, a third place on vault. Huh. Well, yeah. on Melrose Place, women around the world had an infatuation and a lust and a love for him. <laughs> Did you, while watching the show before meeting him? No. You know what? Thankfully, he's Andrew Shue, not Billy. All right. I wasn't the fan of Billy. All right, as a foodie, you mentioned the Food Network and whatnot. Yep. Uh, yes, with Parmesan. With, that's the best. It is, isn't that's it? That's the best. All right, let's see. <laughs> oh, little fun fact. Yes. I'm going to throw him a curveball right, right now. You and I have something in common. We do. You landed and caught, oh, named after there. George Washington, George Bush. <laughs> I landed and catapulted off of... Uh, right, how'd that feel? Like a car crash, oh right? Oh my God, yeah. It was Ooh. unbelievable. It was really cool. It was unbelievable. When you took off, you know... This thing going to the moon. Yes, felt great. All right, next, I have a social question for you, all the way from Glenview, Illinois, from Cindy Wolf. With all my kids and go to the Grand Canyon. I've never done it. That's your bucket list. That's my bucket list. That's something I want to do, but it requires me getting some vacation days. You hear that? I haven't been able to You hear her. that? Yeah. So anyway. <clears throat> All right. Let's get Amy some vacation days so she can hop in that RV <laughs> with her children. Take that off her bucket list as she eats a bucket of truck. Speaking with you today, now we're going to turn back the tables. All turn, right. Oh, turn back the tables. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Nice job. Mm. Woo. Blackish season two premieres tomorrow night at 9.30 Eastern, 8.30 Central. Actor Andrew Rannells here opening up about his new film with Robert.